Our judge has completed her placings in the fall yearling class. Would all juniors please step forward to be recognized? Our second place junior and also third in the class is entry 162, West Meadow Dreamers Vanny, exhibited by Jasmine Wingert of Kent, Illinois. Second place and first junior is entry 164, Old Bankston J.C. Briella, exhibited by Cecilia Winkler, Woodbine, Maryland. And the winning entry is entry 172, Family Affair L. Madison, exhibited by Mark and Becky Brown and Cheyenne Huey of Stitzer, Wisconsin. Congratulations. Judge your comments. Uh, this class starts with uh, by far the most correct individual we have out here t uh, in this group of heifers. Uh, a heifer just straight out over the top, but she's showing me plenty of depth, plenty of openness and spring of rib, and it's the spring of rib in particular uh, and the depth of that rear rib that's placing her over the heifer in second. She also moves more correctly on those rear legs. She keeps them more square underneath of her body. She has a more correct set to the side and tracks more correctly from uh, the rear uh, when she lets us see that. Um, the heifer in second, uh, I love the length of body on this heifer. She is, is so long from, from one end to the other. Um, and she places over the heifer in third because she is a flatter heifer. She's straighter over the top line, more nearly level from hips to pin. She's smoother blending about that shoulder um, and, and just shows more style today than the big tall red heifer lead out in third. I admire the depth in the of the rib and the openness of rib in this third heifer, but it's her, her rump structure, the levelness from hips to pins, the width of thurls, the neatness about the tail head that places her over the heifer in fourth. Fourth then over fifth, a taller, stretchier heifer, one that's just um, shows more scale today. She also keeps those legs um, more correctly underneath of her body than this really wide-rumped, um, deep-hearted, deep-chested heifer we have in, in uh, sixth. 